Hello everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create your white label VAPI dashboard for your agency. First, go to Chat Dash and sign up for it. Once you log in for the first time, you'll see this onboarding page. This onboarding page will walk you through the step-by-step -step process to get your white label dashboard up and running. Click next. And in here, you'll be able to customize your agency's branding that's appeared in your client dashboard. So you can upload your agency logo, customize agency name, and you can even add your custom domain if you have one. But since I don't have my custom domain yet, I will just go with the default subdomain. Click add. For color scheme, I will go with purple this time. And click next. In this tab, you'll be able to add your VAPI assistant, quick VAPI, give chatbot name. For VAPI API key, go back to your VAPI dashboard of API keys and copy it. Paste it. For assistant ID, go to the assistants you want to add into chat dash, copy your assistant ID and paste it in here. Add chatbot. In this step, you'll be able to create a client account and assign this client to the VAPI assistant we just added. I'll give my client name as VAPI client. For login ID and password, I will go with the default ones. Create client, click next, setup complete. Your client dashboard is up and running on this URL. The login page shows your agency domain, logo, and color scheme. Copy and paste this client login ID to log in, sign in. As you can see, this is the exact dashboard that your clients will see once they log in. You can see all the basic analytics and grabs of total car minutes, and number of calls, and reason call ended. We plan to add more granular analytics. You can go to conversations and see all the transcripts of, of your call logs, and you can even listen to this. Hello, this is Ava. How may I assist you today? And your clients will be able to access to knowledge base of your assistant if you want to. So that basically they can see all the knowledge, knowledge base sources of your assistant and download whatever file they want. All these tabs are controllable from your agency dashboard, meaning you can turn on and off analytics conversation knowledge base. For example, you can have full control of your client's journey. For example, you might don't want to show knowledge base of your Bethy system and just, you can just turn it off and save changes. Let me go back to the client dashboard. I refresh this. As you can see, the knowledge base tab has gone and your clients will only be able to see analytics and conversations. And that's basically it for the demo. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions, leave in the comments. Have a great day.